Ukraine announced the destruction of seven Su-25s, Russian aviation is experiencing an apocalypse. The 110th Mechanized Brigade of the Ukrainian Army said that in less than a month it shot down seven attack aircraft of Russian aviation, dealing a crushing blow to Russian aviation and taking some revenge for the defeat in the battles for Avdiivka. According to Forbes, there is convincing evidence that only two Russian Sukhoi were shot down. Therefore, revenge could have been less crushing for the occupiers than reported. The 110th Mechanized Brigade, the Ministry of Defense of Ukraine and even President Vladimir Zelensky announced the destruction of seven Russian Su-25 attack aircraft by Brigade Air Defense Units on May the 4th, 11th, 13th, 18th, 22nd, May the 23rd and May the 25th. As the publication writes, it is not difficult to understand why the 110th Mechanized Brigade can inflate its victories. The brigade has survived a difficult war and perhaps really wants revenge. For more than a year, the 110th Mechanized Brigade stood on the front line in the city of Avdiivka. Holed up in the ruins of the city under constant Russian bombardment, the 2,000-man brigade awaited the inevitable Russian attack. It finally happened in October when the Russian army of at least 30,000 soldiers attacked from different directions. The 110th Mechanized Brigade was desperately short of ammunition largely because Republicans in the US Congress had delayed aid to Ukraine since the same month the Russians attacked Avdiivka. In mid-February, the 110th Mechanized Brigade withdrew, leaving behind potentially hundreds of casualties and turning what was left of Avdiivka over to Russia. After several weeks of rest, the brigade returned to the new front line west of Avdiivka and was very much looking forward to battle. It is possible that the 110th Mechanized Brigade is capable of shooting down seven Su-25s in a month. In late April, the US Congress finally approved new aid to Ukraine and the Pentagon immediately sent billions of dollars worth of ammunition to Ukraine. Moreover, Russian aviation became much more aggressive with its hundreds of Su-25s during the six months when the Ukrainians were begging for ammunition. Most famously, Russian Su-25s regularly flew directly over the front lines around the front line town of Chasov Yar for several weeks starting in mid-April. This was a new practice for the Russians. Before the Ukrainians temporarily ran out of air defense ammunition, Russian pilots typically launched their missiles from a safe distance several kilometers from the front line. It is therefore possible that the 110th Mechanized Brigade had more missiles to fire and more Su-25s nearby. Despite this, there is evidence of only two possible downings and this evidence is limited.